As the scalpel cut into the victim, the blood gushed out. First, her heart was extracted, followed by her kidneys. 2003, Tan Jianming, director of the organ transplant department at the General Hospital of Fuzhou Military Region, performed a kidney transplantation operation for a Taiwanese patient at the Shanghai First People's Hospital. He used eight kidneys over the course of two months. Through our systematic investigation, we found that China's organ transplant industry experienced an explosive growth after 1999. Rush organ transplants emerged after 2006, and the average wait time for organ transplant is extremely short. The average is one to two weeks. Even the phenomenon of reversed organ matching emerged. We've discovered that there exists an enormous living organ donor pool in mainland China. How to be sure that the donor is a Falun Gong practitioner? When the time comes, someone from the higher authorities on our side will provide you with the certifying document, okay? What the Chinese Communist Party has done is extremely similar to what the Nazis had done during the Holocaust. However, the CCP's evilness is far beyond that of the Nazis. If humankind still does not face it, then the world civilization will become completely destroyed. This is devastating. World Organization to Investigate the Persecution of Falun Gong, WOIPFG, was founded on January 20th, 2003. It is based in New York with branches in Europe, Australia, Asia, and Canada. WOIPFG's mission is to investigate the criminal conduct of all institutions, organizations, and individuals involved in the persecution of Falun Gong. To bring such investigations, no matter how long it takes, no matter how far and deep we have to search, to full closure, to exercise fundamental principles of humanity and to restore and uphold justice in society. The principle of our investigation holds that those who have committed crimes shall be brought to justice. Individuals shall bear the same responsibility for their involvement in their organization's crimes, and those instigating the persecution shall bear the same responsibility of those who have physically carried out the persecution. We intend to uproot state-sanctioned crimes and safeguard human morality. The criminal conduct of all individuals within organizations, units, and departments involved in the persecution will be thoroughly investigated and brought to justice.